Okay guys, good afternoon. In this video, you're gonna learn how to do an addendum. And it's very simple. Once you're in from Simplicity, you put your transaction. Once you're there, you have your file here. And what you do is that you add a form. And you add a form because this file's already in the system. These documents are already there. All right, so we go to, you can add it from form packages or from the library. You can pick the document here. You're gonna search for it. And once you find it, you go ahead and you add it. So uh, let's see what's available here. So you can pick one. So as you put here the addendum and you leave all libraries, what you're gonna happen is you're gonna get all the addendums that are available for all the boards or Miami or different boards. So what I suggest is that you use the Florida ones. And once you get that, this is the addendum you're gonna use. But see here, there's a lot of addendums here, auction addendum, backup addendum, cooperative addendum, COVID-1 addendum. So there's a lot of addendums here that you can use specific to your transaction. Short sale, appraisal, financing addendum, right to inspect addendum. So you can pick whatever it is that you need and use specifically for your transaction. Okay, but in this case, if you're gonna have just a regular one, you pick this one here, all right? And you just gotta complete the blanks, seller name, buyer's name, the day effective date. This is the first or second addendum, the property address and the terms. Seller and buyer make the file terms and this part of the contract. Here, what we have is that you can add different you can add different clauses here too. Clauses that have already been prepared. So, for example, you want to add a clause where the seller is going to contribute certain money. You put seller contribution here. You insert the clause, and here it is. If it's not six percent, or three percent, or is it a, a, a an amount twenty five hundred dollars or about twenty. It's very easy, so everything is here ready for you to use. Appraisal continuous, you wanna use that. You can do whatever you want here, okay? So this is how you do prepare an addendum. Once you have it done, you save it, and it will appear on your file, on your folder for that specific client. Okay guys, I hope this message, this video helps you. If you have any questions, please give me a call.